another really interesting scale you can do in the A minor triad. Root position, first three frets of the guitar, um, first four frets basically. We've got our letters again, A, B, C, D, E, F, and G, but this time we're doing F sharpened. That's an orange one. So F sharpened is fret two of the small string. And oh, we're also gonna use G sharpened. So G sharp, that's one fret higher than G. G was fret three, one fret higher is G sharp, fret four. So walking through the scale, third string A, G sharp fret one, A, B, C, D, E. We're not gonna play F on fret one, we're gonna play F sharp on fret two. Not gonna play G fret three, we're gonna play G sharp on fret four, and then fret five for A. So those are the notes, but remember we're trying to target color tones in this one, specifically the triad notes, A, C, or E. So here we go, A jazz melodic minor jam, and the root position around the A minor triad. This is our first box. Eventually we're gonna connect scales around all the different triad boxes on the guitar, and you can link them all together, and then you can glue it all together, and it's this really cool thing where you can play over chords and find the notes that can be extra interesting colors to create melodies and jams for songwriters and improvisers and just people wanting to know more about the fretboard and the guitar music. So here we go. Blue is our super resolved harmony, A, C, or E. But then I'm going to hit the other notes, make a melody, but try to end on blue. triad so it feels like it's based around that home base of the triad chord there. I find a lot of songwriting improvising tends to kind of be very much like this based around this target idea of, of playing around certain notes or chords. So that was the jazz melodic minor. Root position, A minor, triad the home base.